हेलो स्टूडेंट्स इन चैप्टर सेवन ट्रांसपोर्ट लेयर आवर टॉपिक इज सॉकेट मेनली वी सी इन द पोर्ट एड्रेसिंग वी सी वी हैव द नेटवर्क लेयर एड्रेस आई पी एड्रेस इज फॉर द आइडेंटिफिकेशन ऑफ आई पी एड्रेस इज फॉर आइडेंटिफाइंग identifying the host computer in the network computer in the network and the port address is used for identifying the process running in the computer process running in the computer so these two addresses are very very important but sometimes we get a problem when a same computer having two processes wants to communicate with the same other side computer same computer for example our client one computer running two processes process a and b want to communicate with this client to processes both wants to communicate here means we need to differentiate the connection between these two hosts means for this connection is for the communication of process a and this connection is for the communication for the process b this time we need to differentiate the connection when the same computer different processes want to communicate with another computer same process or some different processes that time we need to differentiate the connection between these hosts these hosts this connection is for the communication between these processes and this connection is between the these processes and this is done by, with the help of the combination of these two addresses this is done with the help of combination of these two addresses and we call this combination as called the socket or called the socket address and we call this combination as the socket address okay let's see about this socket a transport layer protocol in the tcp needs both ip address and the port number at each end uh, that we discussed already and the combination of these ip address and the port address is called the socket address it's called the socket address the client socket address defines the client process uniquely just as the server socket address defines the server process uniquely because when they, we want to communicate between the same systems different processes so socket address is ip address is of 32 bit port address is of 16 bit the socket address is combination of ip and the uh, uh, port number so this one is became 48 bit address and this way we can combine these two addresses and this one is became the socket address this one is became the socket address let's see this one with a very very nice example and you can understand mainly here you see socket address is defined interaction between the client and server and the client server is a or the host one and host two or the client one and the client two this one is mainly provide the interactive communication we need two different addresses one is the local address uh, sender address and the other is the receiver address and that's why we define this one with the help of this things okay socket address mainly uniquely identify a connection let's see this example first of all here we have this client machine one and here this one we have the client number two and here this is server both client one and client two are communicating with this server okay in client one we have two processes running one process is having the port number x and the second process having the port number y means we need to define two different connections to the server to provide services for both the processes this way we provide this is the connection one for example this is the connection one for provide communication to the process number x 
having the port number x and this is the connection number 2 of the same client machine to provide services to this process number having port number y so that's why we are maintaining two different connection for two different processes of the same client with the server same client with the server here here this this is the socket communication here we define this ip address of the machine here this ip address of the machine client machine and here the ip address and the port address combination of the server machine okay here the client 2 also here the client 2 also have the same process running as running in the computer client 1 process x here also the same process running in the another client machine 2 same process having the port number x also make a connection this connection is a different connection for the server connection number 3 because the IP address of this client and the IP address of this client is different because the IP address of both the clients are different even their port addresses are same even their port addresses are same okay means we are saying that the socket address should define two things First, define the computer on which the client or the server is running by the IP address, by the IP address. Here you see, we have two things. One is the IP address, first thing, IP address. Because server client or the server process may be running at the same time on a computer, which means that we need to first identify the client machine and the server machine which are involved in the communication. Second thing, second point the port number second point the port number an application program or process running in the computer by the port number 68 and the combination of both makes the socket address that is 16 bit plus 32 bit is equal to 48 bit 48 bit okay and this this 48 bit total 2 key power 48 connections are possible to keep our 48 connections are possible okay here also make a two notes please make a note also first note you please realize that first note here you realize that this computer client have the same ip address client one having the same ip address but same ip address ip address one same ip address ip address one but two different port numbers but two different port numbers same client may choose different port numbers but having the same ip address not one here same client or server machine may have same ip address but different port numbers but different port numbers and this one is defined same ip address but different port numbers are defining two different connections with the server point number two different client may have the different ip address but may have same port numbers different client and server machines may have same port number because two different machines may have the same processes running in them but different ip addresses but different ip address because ip address is the address of a machine or a host with the network machine or the network here you see the same port number x same port number x same port number but different IP addresses but different IP address. IP address is C1 here IP address is C3 IP address is C3 okay please don't get confused in these two points two computers may have same IP address uh, same port number but a different IP address because they are two different machines but in a same machine or in a same computer we have two different port numbers but the IP address is one okay 
that's why we can distinguish each connection uniquely by the combination of this IP address and the port number called the socket address called the socket address and we call that socket address which uniquely identify a connection uniquely identify a connection okay so this is all about the socket address and that's why we are saying our connection is different from another connection